as a responsible government and a responsible people, we must make sure that we have enough resources to execute our plans, not just for one or two years, but long into the future. Our needs are growing on many fronts, such as in healthcare and preschool education. The world is also becoming more uncertain, and it is wise to be prepared. This is why we are planning to raise a GST. I announced two years ago that we will do it in the next term of government. I know it is unpopular. In fact, many of you ask me not to talk about it anymore. Elections are coming. But if I don't bring it up, the opposition parties definitely will. So it's better that you hear direct from me. We could have waited for elections to be over before announcing it. But that would not be the honest thing to do. The responsible thing to do is to be upfront and tell people that it will happen. This is what integrity means. We don't hide from difficult truths. In this way, our people and businesses can plan ahead. And you have my commitment that will help Singaporeans cope with the change. Why do we need to raise GST? We are doing this to better care for our people, to continue providing better and more services so that our seniors can stay healthy and live well, even as they age, to continue to take care of our children so that they can be at their best. How do we help our people cope? Many of you know this. We have GST voucher when we have the GST. The GST voucher is a permanent scheme that helps seniors and lower income households. When the GST rate goes up, we will enhance the GST voucher. I said so in Budget 2018. At next year's budget, I will provide more details of the GST support package. This will cushion the impact of the increase for all Singaporean households. More will be given to those with less because this is fair. We have had such support packages each time we raise the GST. But this time, we are announcing it in advance. This is not an election goodie. The package will only be given when the GST is increased next term. But we know Singaporeans are concerned given the current economic outlook. So we want to assure you that there will be help during the transition so that Singaporeans need not worry or be riled up by opposition who want to find something to get people to be angry. Even with the support package, I know that some unhappiness will remain. So we will need each of you to help explain this to fellow Singaporeans and persuade them why the increase is necessary. Like generations before us, we are taking a bit of pain for the good of our children and generations to come.